Come on, can you worship him right here? Lift your voice and worship him. Oh, we love We honor the Lord this morning, hallelujah. We thank the Father and we greet you this morning in the name of our Lord and Savior, Christ Jesus. We bless the Lord for each of you pressing your way in, hallelujah, as we're in Holy Week and this is Holy Thursday. Hallelujah, we thank God. We thank God for his love that he loved us so much, beloved that he loved us so much that Jesus is willing to lay down his life for us. And so we greet you once again. Um, we know that you know how significant um, this day is, this week is, as we're leading in the final days. Today was uh, the day of the Last Supper. So I'm going to read a little, uh, and then we're going to pray. And then, of course, we remind you again that if you have um, any prayer request in the name of Jesus, please put it in the chat. And, of course, we will stand and believe God with you. We bring you greetings from our apostle who is backstage in the name of Christ Jesus. Amen. We just thank the Lord. and. We're so grateful this morning. We're so grateful this morning. We're so grateful. You know, Holy Thursday, um, evening mass of the Lord's Supper. Okay, let's read. You know, I know I don't have to remind you of everything that you know that's happening. You know, we have journey through scripture every Tuesday night 
and we invite you to continue to come out and participate. It's been really, really good. And then uh, that's Aunt Friend is leading the charge on, on Tuesday night's journey through scripture. And then on Thursday evenings at 7 p.m., uh, we have uh, the Watchman's Gathering. And so we encourage you again to please invite all men out, all males out to this men's group every Thursday night, uh, men ap amongst men, um, that I hear that it's really a good gathering and safe place for men to come and be built up and encouraged and to be able to talk and share and grow and develop. And so please invite all of your husbands, brothers, you know, sons, grandsons out to be a part. And of course, um, the meeting ID and the password is there. So that's happening tonight. Invite, invite, invite in Jesus name. And then last but not least, of course, uh, we are coming into our spiritual retreat. Hallelujah. And it's, he restores my soul. So this is our annual retreat. It's happening May 31st through June, June 2nd. We want you to register. We want you to be intentional in your heart with coming out um, as we celebrate, you know, Christ Jesus, as we celebrate all that God has done for us. And it gives us an opportunity uh, to see each other face to face. So please come out. Registration is $65. You can reserve um, your hotels now. And we want to look forward, hallelujah, to you being there in the name of Christ Jesus. And so we thank the Lord. We thank the Lord for he restores my soul. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, on tonight, on this morning. Glory to God. So I'm going to read from John. John, I think I'm going to do John 13 first, and then we'll go over to John 18, and then we'll pray. Hallelujah. We thank you, Father, on this morning. We've come to give you all praise and all glory and all honor. We're so grateful, saints. We're so grateful. We're so grateful for the precious gift of life. We thank you. We bless your name. So uh, in John 13, it says, Now before the feast of the Passover, when Jesus knew that his hour was come and that he should depart out of this world unto the Father, having loved his own, which were in the world, he loved them until the end. And the supper being ended, the devil now, the devil having now put into the heart of uh, Judas, Judas uh, Simon's son to betray him. Jesus knowing that the father had given him all things into his hands and that he was come from God and went to God. He raised from the supper, laid aside his garment and took a towel and girded himself. After that, he poured water and began to wash the disciples' feet and to wipe them with the towel wherewith he girded. Then come he to Simon and Peter and said unto them, and said unto him, Lord, thou hast washed my feet. And Jesus answered and said unto him, what I do, what I do know, sorry, but Jesus said, but Jesus answered and said unto him, What I do, 
No thou is not now, but thou shall know hereafter. And then Peter said unto him, Thou shalt never wash my feet. Jesus answered him, If I wash thee not, thou hast no part with me. Simon and Peter said unto him, Lord, not my feet only, but also my hands and my head. Jesus said to him, He that washeth needeth not save to wash his feet, but in clean every every wood, and you clean, um, but not all. I'm sorry about my reading on today. For he knew that it would, for he knew he should betray him. Therefore said he, you are not all clean. You are not all clean. So after he had washed their feet and had taken his garment and sat down again, he said unto them, Know ye that I what I have done for you. You call me Master and Lord, and you shall, for so I am. So, um, scripture is running away from me and I'm trying to read. Okay, and so I'm going to read one more scripture and that's, um, it says, The Lord said unto Moses and Aaron in the land of Egypt, This month shall stand at the head of your calendar. You shall reckon in the first month of the year to the whole community of Israel. On the 10th of this month, every one of your families, in the name of Jesus. So all of my devices, and it's hard to read for me this morning, but let's pray, I'm, uh, let's pray. Here is the bottom line, um, that today is the day of the Supper, of the Lord's Supper, that as he was preparing to go and give his life just for us, that no man taketh his life, but that he lay his life down. And so, Father, on this morning, we come before you in the name of your precious son, Christ Jesus. We say thank you, O oh God, for this day. We say thank you, Father, that you loved us so much, almighty God, that you gave your only begotten son, and we thank you, O oh God, for Christ Jesus on this day. That he was willing, Lord God, to become our sin substitute. And that he said that if this cup can pass from me, dear God, let it pass. But if not, allow your will to be done. And so we thank you this morning, hallelujah, that you laid down your life. And we know that a man cannot go beyond laying down his life to show his love. And so we say thank you. We say thank you, almighty God. We say thank you for the sacrifice we say thank you, almighty God, this morning that you had us in mind. That he who knew no sin became sin. We thank you, God. 
and we bless your name. Hallelujah. We give you all the praise this morning. And we give you all the glory this morning that you were willing, almighty God. That you were willing to give your life on our behalf. And so not only that we might live, but that we might live more abundantly in the name of Christ Jesus. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father, for becoming our sin substitute. Thank you, Lord God, that everything that we would ever go through, almighty God, that you were willing to take on humanity, oh God, and that you had settled it in your heart, that you were on assignment, and that you would not turn, but that you came to seek and save us, almighty God. And we thank you this morning that our hearts are humbled. That our hearts are humbled, almighty God. That we're so grateful, almighty God. We're so grateful, Father, that as you prepared, almighty God, yourself become the ransom for us, oh God. That in love, almighty God, you laid it all on the line, hallelujah. We say thank you this morning. We say thank you this morning that love has lifted us, almighty God. We say thank you this morning, Father, in the name, Lord God, of your precious Son, who sits at the right hand, praying for us without ceasing, O oh God. We say thank you. Thank you, O oh God. Thank you for your sons and your daughters. Thank you, almighty God, hallelujah. Thank you, Father, hallelujah. We bless your name this morning. We give you all the praise and we give you all the glory and we give you all the honor, almighty God. For there is none like you. For there is none beside you, almighty God. We thank you and we bless your holy name. Thank you, almighty God. Thank you, Father, that you knew, hallelujah, that you knew, dear God, before the foundation of the world, almighty God, that we needed a savior and that you sent your son, Christ Jesus, to become our sin substitute. We say thank you this morning. And we bless your name this morning, oh God. We bless your name this morning. We bless your name this morning, almighty God. We give you all the praise and glory and honor. We exalt you, oh God. We acknowledge you as Lord and Savior. We thank you. And we bless you. We thank you, almighty God. And we bless your holy name, hallelujah. We bless your holy name, God. We thank you, oh God, for continuing, almighty God, to be the wonderful power of example that you stayed on task that you didn't allow anything to deter you, almighty God. And that you have set the perfect example, almighty God, for being about your father's business. And so we take that same posture on today, almighty God. 
being in divine alignment with every assignment, Father, that you have from us. Thank you, almighty God, in the name of Christ Jesus. Thank you, O oh God, for allowing love to lead us and guide us. Thank you, Father, this morning, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. We say thank you. We say thank you, almighty God, that we stand, almighty God, on this day, Father, that we stand as sons and daughters because of the wonderful work, hallelujah, that you did for us. Thank you, oh God, that we remember you, hallelujah. We remember almighty God, and we say thank you. We say thank you this morning. We say thank you this morning, oh God. We bless your name this morning. We give you all the praise and all the glory and all the honor. We say thank you, oh God, hallelujah. For what type of love is this? That a man would go, hallelujah, to lay down his life for us, oh God. We say thank you. Thank you for continuing to be a lamp unto our feet. Thank you for continuing to be a light into thy path, almighty God. We say thank you this morning, O God. And we bless your wonderful name. Thank you for the work. Thank you for the sacrifice. Thank you for the love. We thank you, God. Thank you that you've called us, almighty God to do a mighty work, hallelujah. To be fishers of men, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. That you commission us, almighty God, to be carriers of the good news. We say thank you, Father. We say thank you, almighty God, as we pray on this morning for men and women that are yet to come into the saving knowledge of the truth, almighty God. We thank you, God, hallelujah, that we pray for salvation on this day, that people will come in from the east, the west, the north and the south, almighty God. We thank you for the laborers on this day that will cross the path, oh God. We thank you for dates with destiny, almighty God because of the love of Christ, oh God, that we've been commissioned to be carriers of the good news, to tell someone about your goodness and your greatness, to tell someone about your love, to remind someone that you have need of them, almighty God, to remind someone, almighty God, that all is not lost, to remind someone on this morning that weeping may endure for a moment, but that joy cometh in the morning. We thank you, Father. We thank you, almighty God. We lift up and encourage the body of Christ on this morning. We say thank you, Father. Thank you, O oh God, for causing us to be strong and courageous. Thank you, almighty God, this morning for causing us to be steadfast. Thank you, Father, for causing us to lead with love in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That we're so grateful, that we're so grateful, that we're so grateful this morning, O oh God that we wouldn't be here, Father, without you and without you sending your only begotten Son, Christ Jesus, that we become joint heirs with, Almighty God. We say thank you this morning. 
We bless your name this morning. We give you all the praise and glory this morning. We magnify and exalt you this morning, oh God. That you're so worthy, you're so worthy, you're so worthy, oh God. You're so worthy to receive all of our praise. You're so worthy, dear God, to receive all our honor, almighty God. All thy admiration, almighty God. We say thank you. We say thank you, almighty God. That you would continue, Father, to be a lamp unto thy feet. And a light unto thy path, almighty God. We thank you, almighty God. That you've called us, O oh God. That you've prepared us, O oh God that you equipped us, almighty God, to do the work, hallelujah, that is before us, Father. We thank you, Father, that you've given us strength, hallelujah, for the journey ahead in the name of Jesus. We say thank you, God. We thank you, almighty God, but we could do nothing without you, almighty God. We thank you, almighty God, for allowing us, almighty God, to be examples, to be examples of love, almighty God, to be examples of love, to lead in love, almighty God. We bless your name, almighty God. We thank you, Father, hallelujah, that you were faithful, Father, unto death, almighty God. And that you knew all things, oh God. And that no man could take your life, that you simply laid your life down. That you made peace, almighty God, with that which had to be done in order for us to have life, in order for us to have it in abundance, almighty God. We say thank you this morning. Thank you for your many blessings, Father. Thank you for your many blessings upon our life, almighty God. Thank you this morning, Father, hallelujah. Thank you for this day. For this is the day that you've made. Thank you, Lord God, for this holy week, almighty God. We thank you, oh God that you're in preparation of going to the cross, that you're in preparation, dear God, of going to give it all up, hallelujah, just for us, just for us, Father. We say thank you. Thank you, almighty God, hallelujah, that we follow after you that we follow after you and so help us oh god this morning to be strong help us to be courageous help us to stay focused almighty oh god on the assignments that you have put before us and that because we're here walking in divine alignment with all that you've called us to be and do almighty oh god we thank you almighty oh god we thank you, Father, hallelujah. And we bless, dear God, your holy name. We thank you that we're joint heirs, almighty God, with Christ Jesus. And we thank you, almighty God. Thank you, almighty God, hallelujah, for all that you've called us to, oh God. Just as sure as there's one body yet many members, and that you have called us each into the body of Christ as you see fit, O oh God. That on this day, we are prepared, God, to walk in your light and to walk in your love. We thank you and we bless you. And we give you all praise and glory and honor for doing it for us, almighty God. 
for being wounded for us, almighty God. We say thank you, almighty God. And we bless your holy name. So saints, this morning we have already reached the top of the hour. Even as we prepare to leave this place, but ever the presence of God, may you go out in this day being strong and courageous. May you go forth in this day in remembrance of all that Jesus did just for us, just for us. And may we continue, hallelujah, as we move through to Resurrection Sunday to know that God is with us, that he goes before us, and that he is a defender behind us, and that we can do all things, hallelujah, in Christ Jesus. Amen, amen, and amen. We bless you all this morning. Say go and be of good courage. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. We thank you. Oh, you are.